tasting good this morning. I was going through my mom's jewelry. Um, most of her jewelry is just custom jewelry. And a lot of it over the years has broken. Um, good morning. <laughs> anyway, uh, a lot of it's broken over the years. And um, those I'm just putting, I have these uh, jars like, peanut jars, you know, the, the jars the peanuts come in, and I'm just putting all the stuff in there, because they're not wearable, um, I did find this necklace, and so I decided to wear it, it it's the right length around my neck, so that it doesn't choke me, so I thought, hmm, I'll wear that one, I just put it on for a little while, I'm really not dressed for a necklace, but I thought it was pretty, and doing my mom's stuff makes me feel close to her, wearing something of hers, and um, it's not easy going through her stuff. It's been, this year will be five years, and it, it's still hard to go through her stuff, but anyway, that's what I've been doing, and waiting uh, to be able to record some of these uh, unboxings, so I'm going to put the camera back down. And we're going to go on with the unboxing because I need to get these done before Stacy starts calling. <laughs> she won't quit because she goes, I want to talk. I'm bored. So I'll get these done and then we can talk. <laughs> so I'm going to put you down. Okay. This one I ordered on the way home from Florida and it was here waiting on me. Uh... No, actually, it came a couple of days after we came home. I believe. I might have ordered this in with uh, my husband's stuff, too. Now, <laughs> my address was showing. Anyway, I, um, I, I wanted to remember to mention this, so I hopped on here right now while my... Since my address was showing, it's not one that y'all need to see right now. And I'll probably fuzz that out. But anyway, um, this is my last year for having a P.O. box. I am going to do away with it as soon as I can. If I can get all the addresses, my address out to people who would like to have my address and if I can figure out how to get my mail without compromising my home. Uh, I don't know if that's the way you say it or not. See, I want to hear from you guys that that have a YouTube channel. How do you do your address? Do you? Not everybody has a P.O. box. I've seen that. So, are you having any problem with your address being on your channel? Uh... You know, if you could leave me a message, it would be greatly appreciated. Uh, and if y'all could start hitting that like button, you know, the thumbs up button, when you watch my videos and help me get these videos out there, then maybe that'll help my channel. I need y'all's help. It's not going to happen overnight, and it's not going to happen by myself. Now, as far as having a lot of people, that... That's not my goal. I don't, I'm not going to plan on monetizing at all. So if you, if that's what y'all's thinking, y'all's thinking wrong. <laughs> I don't want, I'm not going to try making money on my channel. What I want to do is maybe have, you know, get to the point to maybe where I can talk to y'all. I know I can go live on the computer or a laptop, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, but I don't have either one. So. How about y'all helping me get to a thousand? And when I get there, we'll have a good giveaway. And I won't do a giveaway, a big giveaway, till I get there. But I will be doing giveaways. Y'all want to hang around for that. It's going to be cool. Uh, Stacy and I are going to do a Christmas in July. So if you want to order a painting, a Christmas painting, it has to be one that hasn't been started. And we need y'all to send us a picture some way, link it. Um, 
either send it to my email address or Stacy's email address so we know that it's not that we don't trust you but you know a lot of people do take advantage if the if there's a giveaway and I'm not trying to be mean but we we would like to see what are you going to be working on and you know let's all start it together and have fun with it but anyway there will be more about that later on. Let's get into this. This is another painting that... Uh, oh, I remember now. I ordered this after I got home because Hayden wanted it. Now I remember. I was looking at some diamond paintings. And um, this one is, is one that um, she liked as well as I liked. Now, this is not, there is on, on Diamond Art Club has one that I'm going to say is, is, um, the original. I think this is maybe a similar copy. And, um, the guy, the gentleman on Diamond Art Club that has one that is the original I can't think of his name right off the bat, but I'm going to link it so that if you guys want to look on Diamond Art Club and see what the the painting is that that he has, um, uh, you can. But um, I don't I don't I don't know about license licensing and stuff like that. But Stacy said this was um, really similar to the original that um, is on on uh, Diamond Art Club. So, to keep it fair, I'm going to put his name up. Got the uh, just a simple kit, nothing fancy, just a pen, some wax, and a boat. Some of them don't send you much. Some of them are very generous, and some of them aren't. Okay, let's open this up. See how pretty that is? Hayden likes anything that has to do with um, the galaxy. You know, stars and planets. And that's just, that. that is her vibe. <laughs> She's very into that kind of stuff. So, when she saw this, she wanted me to get it. Does it show up pretty good? I mean, this is, there's boats, and then the castle. This one might be a dark to do, dark one to do. There is some multi-placing, but most of it is going to be confetti again. Now, in here, you, there's going to be some multi-placing around this area, but this is all confetti. It, it, it's, it, there's actually a lot of confetti in here. Um, this has got some multi-placing in here, in the dark areas, but 90, 85-90% of this is going to be dark. It's going to be uh, confetti. So if you if you don't like confetti, you wouldn't like this one. But um, it's a thirty by forty, and there's the thumbnail. Don't know if you can tell much from it. Uh, it's uh, got the DMC codes. There's twenty four colors. It tells you down here how to diamond paint. Um, no, it doesn't give you any information other than how to diamond paint. So, like I said, I will um, be putting his name up. I wish I could remember it offhand. You know, it's one of them things that I know. But all of a sudden, my memory just blanks it out. It's, it's called getting a little older. <laughs> it's, 
Anyway, let's get into these diamonds. Um, it has the item number on the, the, the diamonds, but not the DMC code. So, that's a little disappointing. But, we'll go with it. Like I said, there's 20, 24 colors. I'm going to start off this here. Okay, let's see. Some yellow. Gray. That's a green. Some more gray. Some more yellows. Like an orangey color. Uh, grays. Twisted on me. Some blues. Ooh, them blues are beautiful, y'all. And then this one. Um, what number is that one? Number 14. Well, it's not black, but it sure looks like a black. <laughs> but it's uh, a really, really dark, dark, dark blue. Some more blues, like a brownish color, some green, another dark blue. There's some more green. Look at that green. And this is like a brownish color. But it's, no, it's a green, some kind of green, according to the, yeah. Yep, that's a really, that's a mossy green or something. It's a dark, dark, dark green. Anyway, it's a green. <laughs> then, um, let's see. There's two bags of this color. Two bags of 21. And then there's some more brown. Two bags of the green, of the blue. I don't know why they did that. Two bags of the 23. They must have threw them in extra. And... Wow. Okay. And then there's the last one is this here color, like a peachy, brownie, I don't know what you call it, beigey color. I'm not good with colors, y'all. I know my blues, my browns, most of them, grays. But anyway, they're dark. <laughs> it's going to be dark. So, that's all right. I think it's going to be a fun one to do when I get to it. It's going to be a while. But when I do get to it, I think it's going to be pretty awesome. I'm not going to try putting that toolkit back in here. I'm going to throw it in the box in the craft room with the other toolkits. Because... Uh, not going to use it, so I'll just hang on to it, and then if I ever need it, it's there. So anyway, y'all, I thought this was really pretty, and I know Hayden will like it when I get done with it. It'll probably go home with her knowing her. <laughs> But, you know, you can't keep every diamond painting that you do. You got to do some that you can, that you can share, you know, with that special person, you know, with, with your family. Otherwise, you have so many diamond paintings, you wouldn't, they'd just be laying there for no, you know, going to waste, I guess. I don't know. But, uh, another one of them that wants to fight me going in the bag. Um, 
I'm sure well, that um, we're all going to have more than what we can give away to. Now, I saw on the, one of the channels that I watch where the young women, uh, I say went young, I don't know how old they are, but anyway, they sound young. <laughs> I'm saying young, they're younger than me, I know. But anyway, they, um, well, there it is. They, um, have like these portfolios that they put their, some of their diamond painting in. And I've been aiming to look into that. I just haven't done it yet. Because I think they have them, they're a 30 30 by 40, which is what most of my paintings are that I do. I I don't buy a whole lot of really, really big ones unless I splurge and do the Diamond Art Club, which I don't do that often. But I will, because I like them. Anyway, good enough. I know that this one will be another fun one. All right, that's all I got for this one. I'm gonna get off of here. My next one is going to be uh, specials. So I'm gonna get, get going so I can get to them. Say a prayer for me, I'll pray for you. Um, if you have a special prayer, leave it in the comments below or email me. And don't forget to smile and be kind to people. It's important. There's not very much kindness around today. So if you can be kind, let's do it. And I'll catch y'all in the next video. Bye, y'all.